Hello everyone, I'm Lynx4 and welcome to The Cabin, an indie horror game that I found on Game Jolt, although it didn't originate from Game Jolt, this was an indie horror game that was made during a game jam on some other site, I forgot the name, but it's still all indie horror, so let's get into this, oh I'm already into, okay, uh, move, flashlight when found, so I need to find a flashlight obviously, Zoom and interact. I, could f I found a candle. Can I pick up the candle? No, I can't pick up the candle. Use safe. So I need to figure out the combination to this safe. I don't know yet. Uh, was that? Is it only two numbers? It's three numbers? Or is it four numbers? Okay. Yeah, so we're not gonna randomly guess that, even though we have randomly guessed codes before. But probably not in this game. Uh, I don't know what to do with that snow globe. Here's a book. I saw in the trailer they put the book or something into the fire. That did something. That's the only thing I got from the trailer. Is they put a book into the fireplace. And something magical happened, maybe? I don't know. Here's all four books, though. <laughs> and I don't see anything happening. Maybe that's not what you're supposed to do. Well, let's open. I found something in here. A oh, heart. Uh, the key is a broken heart. Oh. Okay. Oh, thank you for the key. Thanks for letting me know. Anything else in here? Wait. I found my key and now my key is over here. I wanted to carry my key around. I need a record. Play that one. So we need to find a code, a record, and I don't know. Some somewhere to put the snow globe. Who knows, the graphics of this game is pretty good. I know during this game jam that they had to do this, they were under um, a limited time frame. I don't know how long, maybe 48 hours or something like that, but the game looks pretty good for uh, having a strict deadline. I guess I have to go through this door. Oh, there's a there's an even a basement I can go in. Let's go through this door. All right, it's my room, I guess. Is this even my place? Where's the flashlight? I wish I had a flashlight. Seems like a secret door on the other side of this. It's really dark. I need a little crest. Man, this is a huge puzzle game. I'm starting to realize. Okay, a pillow. Oh, there's my flashlight. Okay. So now let's look around. Mmm, some paintings. Can't move anything. And that doesn't move. That's locked. Let's see. I found the flashlight. Maybe the snow globe goes on top of this? Nope. That almost seemed like it was what I had to do. Can't pick that up. And there's almost nothing left. There's a dish in here. There's some junk up here. But where's the records? Where? Why isn't this door open? I hope. I don't know how I'm using my flashlight. My flashlight's right there. I don't know. Why is there blood on the wall now? Oh, I can see stuff on the wall. Maybe there's a code on the wall? I think there may be a code on the wall somewhere. Oh, what is this? Oh, there's a lot. The darkness, the what? The darkened place. Light will be your guide. Take it in your hands to find out those that hide. The first clue is crouching, where flames can come to life. Uh huh. The second is upon a man who watches you at night. Okay, yeah, the mannequin. So, this is the clue for the safe, I believe. Um, second is the man. Uh, third is trapped inside a world forever snowy weather. Oh, that's the snow globe. Last, you need just a look above and put it all together. All right, so I think that's the code to the safe. Uh, I said I had to look above. That would be code number four. But where did I put that snow globe? That's code number three, right? Let me see what it... Sh I can't... I 
could zoom in, yeah. Can't really tell anything in here. There's four trees, though. And there's a snowman outside. I think it's four trees. Um, let's see. That was who watches second is upon a man. Yeah, that's number three is four. Okay, so 41 is the last two numbers. Hello. You watch me at night, don't you? Maybe that's not you. Oh, zero. So, zero forty-one. The last code is in here. Eight zero four one. There we go. That wasn't too hard. Eight zero four one. Correct. Ah, yeah. Oh, we got the the mannequin head, and we got another book. Maybe that's the book I have to put. Oh, uh, can you can you please roll? Oh, hi. Huh? What well, just opened up? Something opened up, but before I do that, let me put this book over here, because I saw it in the trailer. No, putting all the books in there. It's not working. Why isn't anything working? I don't know, maybe that's just supposed to throw me off a little bit. So I'm assuming this door opened up in this room. Alright. The atmosphere in this... Huh, that's kind of weird. Atmosphere in this game is really creepy. Somebody trying to record the restroom? Well, now that's really creepy. Wait, why is that a restroom? Your guide... Wasn't that the... Wasn't that the... The bedroom? I don't get it. The bedroom's not the bathroom? The game changed on me? I don't know. I don't know, but we got the coin. And we got the record. And we got more books. More books to put in the fireplace. Let's go ahead and put these books in there and see if anything will happen. Come on. Nothing. See, I go in here. Here's the... Apparently it's outside. What? Huh? Wait, was this always a, a bathroom? Did I make a mistake here? That's... I don't know. Let's go ahead and put it on here. Now what? Yeah? Huh? Oh. Oh. It opened up the creepy little... How am I supposed to get back up here when I go down there? Huh? How am I... Uh, all right, let's uh. Woo! Oh, is it a way out? The way out? I don't know. It seems like it might be the way out. Get me out of here! I don't want to be here anymore. Thank you. Is that? Is this the way? What's happening? I don't know. The cabin. All right, I, huh? Yeah, so that was the cabin. Um, as far as horror elements, it's really all atmosphere in this game. And it was just made under a short time frame, but I liked it. The puzzle elements were good. The graphics were good. I wish they would have upped the scares a little bit more. I don't know if it was necessarily meant to be a horror game because it wasn't made for a horror, um, like game jam kind of thing it was just made for a first person I think it was like first person shooter kind of game jam but this seemed like had horror elements to it and it did it was a little creepy the mannequin head and just this deer antler thing in the beginning and I don't know it had a lot of creepy elements to it it was a really good puzzle game I like how everything just flowed and it was smooth and it was good so Thanks for watching. Links for out. Oh. I just want to go all the way over there. Ah! Oh god! Oh! 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 Okay. Ah!